Hello my name is Henry and today I'm going to go to Toys R Us. The reason I want to go to Toys R Us is, because I bought a spoon there a long time ago, and it broke, when I tried to polish it yesterday. And I want to return it. I go outside, only to realize Toys R Us went out of business years ago. At first I get mad, but then I see a time machine store and I begin to walk there like qua 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 to run 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 this is getting tiring run 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 and before I know it I make it to the time machine store I walk into the time machine store and I see bingo bunny bingo bunny says welcome to the time machine store can I help you I say you can help me by lending me one of your time machines right now he tells me that if I'm going to use one of his time machines I better have a good reason for doing time travel I tell him that I want to go back in time to when Toys R Us was still open, so I can get a refund for the spoon. He tells me that Toys R Us is back, and I have to go to Macy's to find it, and I tell him, that I don't have facking time to go to Macy's, and I doubt there are any Macy's nearby so let me borrow your time machines right now Mr. Rabbit Dick. He says okay, and he shows me the TARDIS, and says this is the TARDIS, it is a very powerful time machine, so use it with caution, and don't fuck up any part of the space-time continuum. I say okay, and I travel back to when Boys R Us was still open. I begin to walk into the store when all of a sudden I'm stopped by a huge ass line of parents with their spoiled brats of children. I begin to wait like, you know what? Fuck it. This cannot wait. So I start pushing everyone over like push 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 out of the way 100% unsatisfied customer coming through push 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 you parents should be ashamed of yourselves for taking your kids to this shitty store push 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 and I end up at the front of the line I get into the store and I walk my way to the checkout and I face the cashier the cashier says, Welcome to Toys R Us where we sell the toys, would you like to buy anything? I slam my broken spoon on the counter, and say I want to return the spoon I bought from you guys, and it broke, when I was polishing it. I want a full refund for my troubles right now or else I'll get not very nice. The cashier says first of all, you don't have to yell at me. Second, we do not do refunds for that product, all sales were final when that was sold, didn't you read your freaking receipt? Third, that is not a spoon, it's clearly a shovel. Get educated Mr. Penguin. I then get so mad, that I say give my money back right ficking now. The cashier says please, don't swear in front of the kids. There is no need, to escalate the situation further. I reply to him by saying that's it. If you will not give me my fucking money back, I'll get it back myself. Then I jump behind the counter, and I open the cash register and I take all the money out of it, and I do the same thing with the other cash registers, because I paid the equivalent of what was in those cash registers, which is a lot of money. I don't remember how much exactly, but it was still a lot. The cashier gets the other employees and they try to stop me from getting my money back, but then the alarm went off, and it sounded like we do. Everybody evacuates the store and the employees leave also, but not before uttering, Oh boy, you're going to get it now. Then I grab one of their shopping bags, and begin to bag up the money. But then a shadowy figure starts inching closer towards me as I bag up my refund money. The moment I finish collecting my green stuff, I look up, and find none other than the manager, better known as Jeffrey the Giraffe, with a very pissed off look on his face. In his traditional managerial-like mannerism, he says what the fuck is going on here. I tell him, that I'm getting a refund for my spoon that broke, and he tells me not to steal from the cash registers over a broken shovel. It's not a shovel I reply back, it's a spoon. What kind of shitty business are you running here? If you think customers will buy your cheap shit not expecting them to break, you've got another thing coming your way Mr. Giraffe. He screams how, dare you insult my business and steal all of my cash, I'm going to punish you for this. He starts making some toys come to life via his giraffe magical powers. But before he could make them attack, I begin to beat the shit out of him like bam 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 punch 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 kick 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 max 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 now I show him with my feathers, and he starts coughing, and he passes out. I walk out of the store with all my money, and I travel back to my house knowing that I finally got my money back. I hope you enjoyed my short story. Thanks for watching and goodbye.